All right, all right, all right, ladies, gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, welcome back to Mass Effect Andromeda. How you doing? I hope you're doing all right. We uh, we drove all the way back up here to confront the Turian woman who gave us that nav point and tried to screw us over, I think. You got some explaining to do. Back again? That nav point was a setup. Setup? Was the cache not there? Yeah, but so were a lot of exiles who tried to kill me. I'm not responsible for the actions of my other customers. Other customers? I may have sold the nav point to multiple people, but in my defense, I didn't think you'd all show up at once. I want my credits back. Sorry, sweetheart. I don't do refunds. Besides, you got your weapons. But I don't like unhappy customers. I'll give you a discount for your trouble. That's more than fair. Ooh, hello. Roll initiative. <laughs> All right. So we're on we're on the uh on the up and up to finish Kadara sometime today. So let's see. This could be next. What we gotta do is jump down. Or fly down, depending on how you view what we just did. Gotta say, I was hoping for more yar pirates and less shooty pirates. <laughs> the Angara were all alone here until the catch showed up. Can you imagine wondering if you're the only sentient species in the galaxy? Yeah, it's what humans do and did for quite some time before. I believe the Turians were the first contact with aliens they had in Mass Effect. So yeah. <laughs> and, and that's some shit. That's really some shit. You know Ryder won't let anyone else drive this thing, right? <laughs> what? You've driven this thing? Who else? Is it everyone else? Oh, never mind. Oh my god. Oh, is that the vault? There's the vault, okay. It sure as hell is the vault! Alright, screw it, let's make a pit stop at the vault. We're gonna have to go around since we can't go through the water. Let's just park out here. Purify the planet. Square one, at least it comes okay. to here. Remnant vault. Let's get this place up and running. Well, we turned the power on. You'll need to locate the console to activate the purification field, Pathfinder. Several interface connections converge here. I will highlight the ones you need. Huh. Okay. One more. All right, we're good to go. Okay, you should be able to get to the purification console. The creature. Any more? I don't see any. It's 
a little fun, isn't it? The unknown. <laughs> Where's the other player? Go. Speak of the devil. What do we got? Hello. We've got targets. Oh, oh, this is a um bridge. Oh shit! It's one of the big ones. Me again, or hit you again. Shit, you hit hard, quite hard. Pathfinder, the way across is console activated. Okay, what is this doing in place of the barriers? Pathfinder, this has two interface functions. Okay. Remnant, we can lay low or take them on. I don't think laying low is something we have the option to do. There's no stealth component of this game. Okay, it knows we're here. We all just open fired on the thing. Yeah, I, I sort of knew that was coming. Oh god, two nullifiers? I need... That is the wrong button. That's the wrong button. I don't have any disruptor ammo. Here's hoping that tank doesn't hit me from behind. Alright, the destroyer is focused on Vetra. <laughs> Sorry, Vetra. She got both of the guns down. Okay. Oh, shit. Turrets nearby, Pathfinder. Occupied. There we go. Nice work. What's up here? Well, look at this. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Huh? 
I don't really know what that did. Good one, Ryder. It, it good one what? What did I do? What did I unlock? All right, cool, whatever. We have to find the purification uh, module. It's probably that up there. Get any ammo I need. something there must be a trick to this let's give it a try Valuable data, Pathfinder. You may want to scan it. Okay, that's two of nine. <laughs> Another one of these boxes. They're all over. <laughs> so it's obviously a cross. Question is how do we get across? Remtech, but we can grab it on the way back. Yes, we can. I will add this map to your interface, Pathfinder. Hmm. There's gotta be a way across. Jumping is not an option. Screw it! Okay, jumping is an option. I don't think it's a helpful one for uh, getting out of here, but... What do you... What do you do? This looks like it might have a boss fight component. Interface connections, Get all of these activated. Here they come. Uh oh. Here who come? Where's the remnant? There they are. What the 
Don't hit me. Someone took out my life support. Oh shit! I can't activate the console either. Almost got you, almost got you, thank you! Who's left? Hello. To activate the purification field, you may want to sweep the area. Before this place tries to kill us, you mean? Here it comes! Go, go! Quickly, quickly! Okay! Come on, come on! Let's hit that on the way out. Oh shit, oh shit, it's right there. Vetcher jogging through at the last minute. Damn, never gets less terrifying. Let's get out of here. Damn it, the beasts are coming. They always come after us. Alright, um. This road should take us directly to where we need to go. There's hope for Kadari yet. Yeah, we're almost good to place an outpost. Come on. I hate, I hate mountains and hills in this game. Come on, you almost got it. I gotta get up to more flat ground. Son of a bitch, we're heading right towards one of those things. We going the right way? Yes. Ice peeled, everyone. Don't worry, I'm not blinking. If there's something to see, I'm gonna see it. You'll see. Maybe look with your eyes, not your mouth, huh? <laughs> oh, God, you gotta love them. Come on, get up. There we go. We're approaching the scavengers that stole the Angoran satellites Activate and destroyed the surge vessel. What are the odds they'll surrender peacefully? Less than 1%. Oh god, already? Jesus! Mining zones have been added to your nav system. Up by Shit, that's 
Wrong. Very wrong button. There we go. Reinforcements. want to. I thought I launched all the fuckers off! There we go. And his body just slaps down. As it should be. Trash taken to the wind needs to be cleaned up. I don't see satellite parts. In here? Scavengers chopped those missing Angaran satellites into scrap. I'll have the Tempest retrieve what's left for transport to Aya. No Angara here. Just our people. Let's, um, not terminal, let's see if we can fill out our loadout once more. So, let's, uh, jeez, uh, okay, cryo ammo works, I guess. Alright, so what's next on the map? One turn by pirates and night. Look at the nomad, all beautiful and N7 like. Hey, B, what's your full name again? Peanut Butter? My full name is Peanut Butter. That's my story, and I'm sticking to it. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your God. mining interface. PB really likes fucking with people. It's different when it's harmless, but like, don't be a dick otherwise. Life lessons. Looking to see what's up. Oh, shit, shit. Can I really not get up there? 
There we go. Hi there. We're not looking to cause any trouble. Trouble is all there is on Kadara. We just want to be left alone and... Wait. I don't believe it. You look like a Pathfinder. <laughs> I take it no other Pathfinders have strayed this far? I wish. Oh, it's good to see you. Just knowing the initiative's still out there making it work. That means a lot. Looks like you've got a good thing going here. We're refugees hiding on a world of exiles. We got kicked out of the Nexus, swept away in the uprising. We weren't looking to take sides or anything. We just wanted to eat. Then we found this place. Remote, sheltered from the crazies in the Badlands. And the bedrock here filters the water. If you can spare the time, we could use your help. Speak to the others and they'll fill you in. All right. I'll unlock the doors. I hear you guys need some help. Oh, hi there. Something wrong? It's just hard. Exiled from the Nexus. My mother's still back there. I never said goodbye. Have things gotten any better? Yeah, a lot better. Better than it was. It'll take time, but life might actually get back to normal. Oh, that's good to hear. I just wish I could talk to my mom. I've been trying to reach her, but our equipment's broken. Not sure it would matter. The Nexus is so far away. Never know. I could take a look. Would you? That would mean the world. All right. Scan the broken antenna. Is he okay? No. Running a fever. Something weird bit him and he's got an infection. Usually remedies don't work on the venom. Anything we can do for him? Unless you can conjure up some sort of antibiotic out of thin air, I don't know. Hmm. Not really anything I can do for him, I guess. The communications junction is out of alignment. With an adjustment, a signal could reach the Nexus. How's it looking? I appreciate you looking into it. Okay. <laughs> Alright, back in! Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Let me go this way, right? Maybe the scavengers will be reasonable. First time for everything. Doubt it. Oh. Well, dead is a kind of reasonable. Yeah. Something did work. Someone got to them first. And destroyed Ashland's missing parts. What the hell did this? Oh god. Fiend! Where is it? Oh! Cryo. Freezing hell, you bastard. on the bad news. Wait a minute. 
Where's the nomad? Is it way <laughs> over here? Wait, what? So we're going to do this next. Short answer? Never been before. That's it? Yeah, why not? You girls okay? <laughs> oh. oh, do I really have to um answer the email if I know where I'm going? I guess so. Um Well, here's the closest point to that one. I think I can check from here, can I? Does the terminal give me access to email? Nope. I might have to go back to the Tempest. That's great. What is this? This is memory trigger. This all the way out here, memory trigger. Something about a relic. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. I know, you Sam. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. You tell me this every time I pass over a mining site. This technology is not registered to either of Kadara's factions, Pathfinder. You tell me that every time I pass by here, too. <laughs> Oh god. Oh jeez. Alright, let's uh talk to Aslan or something, however you say her name. Hello my lady! Found your scavengers. Dead. A fiend got them. And the turbine parts? Destroyed. Nothing left but scrap. <sighs> I'll take satisfaction knowing my yard drive isn't being used by a bloody scav. Thanks, Pathfinder. Goodbye. Stay safe. Yeah, sure. Okay. So... Let's quickly travel to the Tempest and land back. What's up, Ryder? Why an emergency meeting? I didn't call it. I did. Got some disturbing news while we were on Kadara. There's some tension at the Krogan colony on Eladin. It's bad. Tension among Krogan? You don't say. I wouldn't waste your time with this if it wasn't important. We need to go. I agree. Nakmor Morda made herself overlord of the colony. It's weird. No. Our priority is the Archon. We have to remain focused on his next move. Jal's right. We won't make any rash decisions. Drax just brought a problem to the team. Let's dial down the emotions so we can be clear-headed. Well, as long as we're pitching stuff, 
I overheard outlaws on Kadara talking about activity in the Ramav system. No, that's the system where the Turian Golden World was supposed to be. Ramav? There aren't any viable planets there. Only an asteroid field with mining ventures run by criminals. I hear Elodin's pretty rough too. Roving scavengers with nothing to lose. Perfect. Because if there's one thing I do know about, it's fighting pirates. <laughs> but now that we have the transponder, we're so close to finding the location of Archon's ship. Let's stay open-minded about our it. Our goal is to create our home here. You never know how something might fit in. Anyway, get Kello the nav points for both Elodin and that potential Turian Golden World. We want all our options ready to go. Hey! I didn't say dismissed or meeting adjourned or anything. Meeting adjourned as you were. I guess they just don't really care. All right, so let's check our email. Oh, I can't jump over this. This is weird. In the armory. Okay, Vetra wants to talk. We'll probably end up talking to her once Pathfinder, we get back from finishing email. Kadara. Sorry, Arkcore has got something. Sid sent something. From Moshai, meaning Axul. Arknatanis. Oh, on Elodin. Okay, so that gives us more reason to go. Please see me, Captain Dunn. Jeez, we got a bunch of things to do. Another interview. Okay. All right. That's kind, Subi, but I don't think it will help. Now we're orbiting Kadara. We're gonna land back. Okay. Since we're up here, let's talk to the outcasts because that's something we need to do to settle the place. Sloan. Ah, shit. I have a proposal for you. If you've, you've handled your fair share of cat. <laughs> Hard to get far in Andromeda without running into them. Yes, and? When Sloan took over, she slaughtered the cat who were here. There were mass executions, public. So people would know that Kadara was cat free. There have been rumors of stragglers in the Badlands. If the tales are true, they need to go. Heard any cat rumors? What exactly are the rumors about the cat? Ambushes. People disappearing. Vehicles sabotaged. Pick clean for parts. Mm. Could be feral local wildlife, sinkholes, and gar bullshit. But there's enough people saying cat. You said Sloan killed the cat here. What happened? The cat had the port locked down when we arrived. They were shipping Angara off for who knows what. People were scared. But the place had potential. So we fought the cat for it, and we won. You saw the decorations outside. That's Sloan making sure everyone knows she's the new power. If there are cat out there, send your own crew to deal with them. Listen, this is how it is. Everyone knows Sloan destroyed the cat presence here. Anything that hints otherwise, weakness. But you, you're independent. Where you go, what you do, nothing to do with Sloan. Okay, so you want it taken care of discreetly. I'll think about checking out the Badlands. Excellent. All right, help Ke uh, Kytus with the uh, cat. Good, that means I don't have to look at or speak to Sloane. She's a bitch. Just an ill-tempered douche. Come on. We 
go. <coughs> and we can talk to Reyes once we get down there. Oh, probably should have bought more uh, consumables. Oh well. Thank you. You're that initiative big shot, aren't you? Maybe, maybe not. Do I owe you credits? Ah, you're a playful one. I like that. You could say I'm disillusioned with the exiles. People here can't be trusted. Sooner stabby in the back than work together. So, I got no love for any of them. They don't deserve you. Damn straight. Outlaws got innovative ways of putting stuff together. I bet a smart one like you could learn a lot from scrutinizing our, uh, stuff. You should check out Outlaw Tech and Materials. Might learn a few things. You remember who gave you the skinny on that. Okay. I don't know your name, but okay. Ryder, perfect timing. You saved me the trouble of looking for you. You're a needy guy, Reyes. Stop being useful, and I'll stop bugging you. Uh, give me the details. A business rival, Zia Cordier, lifted cargo I was moving for a client. You want my help getting it back? We worked so well together on the row car job, I thought you'd be willing. What did she steal? No idea. Client paid extra for privacy. <laughs> Considering my fees, it must be valuable. You didn't check. Honor's got a price. And the yeah. client paid it. How'd this rival of yours get hold of your cargo? Her usual tactics. Got my middleman drunk and stole his ship. Sounds like you know from experience. Please, I keep to a three drink maximum when I'm on a job. Okay. For a price, buddy. We cut the profits 50-50. 60-40. Final offer. Deal. When she stops in Kadara, Zia drinks at Krala's song. We'll start there. See if Umi heard anything that could help us. Okay. Looks like I gotta go back upstairs. Well, I guess upstairs is sort of a false but more like a couple of miles up above ground. I wish I could wear my armor up here. I understand no guns, but... You know, just in case. What can I get you? Don't say surprise me. So what's the latest in Kadara? The port's on the brink of civil war. The charlatan and the collective have been gunning for Sloane's throne. Thought it was all talk until they started killing each other in the Badlands. You're pretty calm about it. When you live in a place run by pirates, violence becomes relative. I'm not gonna worry until the shooting's outside my bar. Understood. How do you feel about Sloane? Do you like her? I like Sloane fine, but her protection fees can go to hell. She makes you pay for protection? Yep, and the price of safety keeps getting higher. Can't complain too much, though. The outcasts are my biggest customers. Right. You mentioned the charlatan and the collective. Yeah, what about them? 
Who are they? <sighs> wow, you're new here. No one knows who the charlatan is. That's kind of the point. He, she, they, whatever, run the collective. They like to think of themselves as some kind of spy network. Bet they're just thugs. Might be a little smarter than the outcasts, but no one's got the moral high ground in Kadara. Right, okay. Thanks for the gossip. Part of the job. Whiskey, neat. That's the only way we serve it. That was a little anticlimactic. You look like you're waiting for someone. That's my line. Oh, you want a drink or a room? Information, actually. That'll cost you more than a round of drinks. My friend's good for it. Cheap bastard. You still owe me for the last time. Fine, fine. It was just a joke. I've got a bottle of Elasa I'm willing to part with. <sighs> what do you want to know? Zia Cordier. She been around recently? You mean your ex? Yeah, she was here. He never mentioned Zia was her girlfriend. Oh, she's not. We drink together sometimes. I drink with a lot of people. Anyway, she was here? Yeah, met with a Solarian. Shifty guy I'd never seen before. Maybe it was the charlatan. Anything's possible. You overhear their conversation? They were planning to meet someone at Spirit's Ledge. Thanks, Umi. Whatever. You didn't hear it from me. If you check the meeting spot, I'll follow the collective lead. Doubt Zia was meeting the charlatan, but you never know. Uh, sure, take the easy job. Why am I always stuck with the hard work? Because I'm the delicate one. Call me when you get to the meeting spot. Right, right, the delicate one, sure. Hey, Drac. You know, Kadara ain't half bad. Nexus could learn a thing or two. Why do you drink here instead of Tartarus? This place has Umi. She gets me. Oh, or at least she keeps pouring. <laughs> okay. Who do you think the charlatan could be? Anyone or no one. A lot of people would rather get behind a story than face reality. True. I assume you have opinions about Sloan. That's putting it lightly. Sloan switched sides. Helped the uprising when she was head of Nexus security. I don't like Tan any more than I like her, but loyalty counts. Right? How does this place stack up to the Krogan colony? Hard to compare. The colony's ours. It works for Krogan. But these exiles are onto something here if they can just get along. Okay. Don't have too much fun. We'll see. Oh, come on. I, I hate the doors in here. They don't work very well. Wait, who is this? Is this somebody I know? That's Vetra. Nobody. All right, where's Vetra? I want to see what she's doing up here. Where is she? Oh. Apparently, half the people I knew left in the uprising ended up here. I'm just happy for them, good for me, and good for the Nexus. You didn't hear me say that. Lips sealed. Thanks. I'm trying to protect you too. If leadership finds out you know about me trading here, you have enough to deal with. I don't want to give them reasons to meddle. Appreciate it. I've got a couple calls to make, so I'll let you go. I mean, there's not too much they can really do. Not right now. Or kind of ever. I'm the whole reason they can eat. How's that pistol working out? It's fine. Right, where's the, uh... Where's the actual console I can buy shit from? Or do I just talk to him? Whatever you... Kadara's honored by your presence. And your credits. Finally, the respect I deserve. Happy to oblige. 
nothing I really want, but I can sell salvage. Although I might try out that Lancer. Squishy thing like you needs protection. Got the best armor in all of Kadara. And the most expensive, apparently. You look like you can afford it. Right. Anything good? Not really. All right, we're gonna be heading back down. Oh, hey, Cora. Guarding the Tempest? The Nomad. Got some attention when we disembarked, and it's a lot more portable. Seems smart. Only three attempts to steal it so far, and one offer to buy it. Really? How much? What was the offer? Just so I know how much I'm driving around. Negotiations fell apart when he asked if I came with the car. Oof. Weird. Must have been something I aimed. Okay, that makes sense. Time to go down. All right, and when we return, ladies, gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, we're going to figure out the rest of Kadara. So I thank you so much for watching. If you're on YouTube, like, comment, subscribe. On Twitch, drop me a follow, and I'll see you all next time.